quick change here. Weedless out. That's gonna go back in. No, I'm gonna put that there so it doesn't rust. Um, oh, bro, right in front of the Longy, <laughs> there. Okay, we've got a Faster, yeah. half ounce 4 0 here. Bit of all. Very still warm. Oh, yeah, let's just bottle over there. And... Yes, sir. All right, these ones are definitely coming this way. Let's see if I can lead them. They were. We were right there too, like. There he is. Oh, what? There he is. This led the school. <laughs> Go, send one in there. <laughs> oh, got a good stock. <laughs> Slow him down. <laughs> How's the sound of the bait cast? Yeah, <laughs> I don't know how they didn't hit me Oh, oh wow! <laughs> They're sending it! A bit of a weird monster happening. Oh, not a bad start for the morning. So today we don't have too much time. We have a big South Easter coming in. We're heading over to do something very different. Uh, we're going to test out a couple of things and try and sight try and find and side cast big salties salty barrett in amongst um tuskies and grunner and all kinds of stuff i've been having a look at some ground and absolute stunning morning man this thing's been stubborn it's good fish <laughs> <laughs> so oh he's big Wow, that's so much hurt on him. <laughs> oh, look at the bag. <laughs> so we thought we'd quickly just, you can't help but like, glass out big longy school. Have a quick cast. Voila. But yeah, we're about to get onto the flats. Do some really cool stuff, I hope. And worst case, oh, sorry. Oh, how's his form? I think he's proper hoofed it. Oh yeah, it's in there. Yummy. Oh, you wanted that. All right, buddy. He's a good journey. start right so the plan today is um we've got this really really nice kind of rocky corally landscape here the odd little mangroves it's kind of the perfect recipe for me we're looking at big tuskies and then the other thing too is we're quite quite close to the close ah, quite close to the coastline so the idea of actually seeing a big barra on these flats or in amongst these rocks coming up is a very real thing. So we've got the motor at the moment. We're sitting on three, something I, um, I'm very, very strict about with electric motors and being as quiet as possible. The worst thing you can do as well is you, um, you be cruising along and you don't see anything for a little bit and you start bumping it up to four and five and you get a bit impatient. What is, oh, it's a huge barracuda. There you go. Just shows what actually can be on these flats. Like, so basically as quiet as you can be, 
and just scanning in a Z motion. And you're just kind of working close, working up, working down, looking for anything that's just a bit abnormal, something different. And um, that way, if you're on three or less, you can kind of stop and the boat won't push forwards too much. But we're coming in now to this like really nice rubbly rock. So I'm gonna put the GoPro back on and proper focus on what's happening because I really think we're gonna see something soon. See, like to me, there should be jacks and Oh my God. Oh, there's another one. There's another one. I just heard him kick. I can see him. I can see him. Oh, he's boosting. Oh, there he is there. Oh, bro. Look at them all. There's one just here. There's another one there. Oh my God. Look at that. Oh my. Are you kidding? Oh, how sick was it when it came out? That thing was huge, yeah, man. That was metery. Up, up in, what, 300 mil of water? Wow! You have a good day, buddy. There, there. There are those moeys. Yep, yep, oh, yep. just here, just here, just here. Yep. Oh, my God! Sorry. I'm good, I'm good. Here, let me have a go on Just, oh, there's two just here, two just here. Big one. Hold on, hold on. Oh, no, no. Just there's one there, there's one there. Bring it to him, just stay low. He hasn't seen it. He'll see that. No, nah, it spooked him. I heard him eat and it just went whoop. And I went, that's not a jack and hit him. Why did it not stick like? Two of them. No, look at that. Oh, dude. So, see if I can see him. Same thing, just pitch it. There he is there. That's him there. He's heading slightly left. He's still there. So pitch cast it. towards, cast towards the rocks in the middle of the sand. Yep, bring it hard right. Ring, 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 ring. Stop there, got him. Yeah, you got him. Oh, it's a tusky, man. Just don't go too hard. Don't go too hard. Let him go. That wasn't that wasn't him. That was a tusky. Okay, if he burns hard right, then you're going to have to give him some, but that's perfect. All right, you've got him. You got him. Holy, didn't he just rocket onto that? <laughs> that's a good tusky, man. Got a nanny? Oh, uh, you just got to semi-comfort lift him in. Wow. First one. Oh, yeah, he's a cracker. You want to grab him? Yeah, let him. You should have him. Oh, he's not hooked up, bro. Have you got a net? Yeah. Oh, you do. Oh, stop it. I don't even know what nets are. You just scoop them, eh? Yeah. <laughs> oh, yes. Yeah, doggy. Are we just killing it or what? Oh, he took us. He took the plastic. The old prototype done the job, eh? Man. What do you reckon, buddy? Oh, we've just. It was definitely a br blubbery, but I think what happened is he was cruising around. He was him. cruising around him, yeah. And then you've pitched gotta, it in, and he's just. Should I grab my camera? I've got Evan with me today, and. I don't know what's happening, but look, we've nailed the ties, we've nailed the weather. There's a reason why we're out here doing this, and this is why. That's a solid tusky. So they're called black spot tuskies because you can see this black spot here. And they use these teeth to just absolutely 
Something. Smoked crabs and shrimp. That is a proper good fish. Just stay low, stay low. Oh, he's on it, he's on it. Yep. Oh my god! Oh. Bro! This thing's a monster. Oh, here's a proper one. <laughs> oh, here's a proper one. Yeah, he's insane. <laughs> Whoo! This is this is as good as it gets. No hesitation. Just straight up to it and smoked it. Oh yeah. Wow. Oh. <laughs> Whoa. Stop it. That's that same little hard pack jig head. You saw how much hurt I put on that thing. We're going Stop it. I'm gonna be really quick with him. That's an absolute giant. Oh, he's paying. Okay, we're gonna go straight back in. Yes. <laughs> it's been the most hectic hour. Oh, you got your card. He got his, uh, he's got his revenge on my fingers there, but. <sighs> this is pretty amazing. Um, you can see we kind of started back there and the way I explained it, like we've done nothing different. We've just, we've just crept along ultra slow. Like it may look super bright. I'm not too sure what it's going to look like in the footage, but there's like this wispy cloud, which is just so awful for sighting these fish, but we're just ticking along so incredibly slowly. And that was a proper one. Like he was pushing 70 centimeters, that fish. Uh, for anyone who does the old comment like, oh, sort out your drag washers, you've obviously never locked your thumb in the spool and heard that noise. That noise of like that, <laughs> that's the spool on your thumb. Like that thing, I'm running 40 and 50 litre, and I reckon I was pushing that to the limits. Like you saw all the bombies and stuff getting around here. We're not mucking around. So... I'm just, I'm wrapped. We've given those barra a break. We're going to go back there, but I have a very uh, strict kind of rule with fish. Once you upset them, leave them alone. Just leave them alone. Don't harass them. Like we only hooked two and there might've been 10. So we're going to idle, or not idle, but we're going to electric back there because we've got the start of the incoming tide here. So the start of the incoming all the fish are kind of waiting. They're waiting for their chance. As soon as the start, tide starts pushing, they push with it. So we're going to have like a complete fresh influx of fish come through in the next hour. So once we've gone through, the only thing I'm a bit worried about is when you turn around because I've set myself up with the sun basically on the angle behind me so I can see down and I can have a better view. Um, what we might have to do is drive like 500 meters out all the way back around and then start again. Because if I look back in that direction, um, if you look back down, you can kind of see the glare from the sun. So you got to consider all that stuff when you're doing it. You know, it's like, it's not just a matter of pull up on the flats and have a look. It's pull up, 
a kilometre short of the flats. Consider the tide, the wind, and especially the sun when you're siding stuff. Baritone. All right, GoPro's on. Mm -hmm. I'm going to roll it until we get to the end there. Um, I'm in two mindsets whether or not to be casting in front, but I feel like it's a sight casting day. So I want to just, if we see Barra, then I'll hit him. But if we get really close to those rocks and don't see anything, I'll have a cast. But I'm going to finish my beer. That's going to go down. We're going to get in the zone here. So, we're looking for big giant blue blobs, big yellow tails, and the odd chrome. That's a lot of water. Mm. I don't know what that was. Oh, bit going on up here. It's happening. Oh, yeah, Tusky, straight in front, just here. He's right next to that blubbery. Just pitch it, pitch it right. Bring it, bring it, bring it, bring it. Keep bringing, keep coming, keep coming. Keep coming, keep coming. Keep coming. Okay, stop. Stop, 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 stop. Stop, 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 He's got it. Oh! You... Ooh. No, he had nothing on it. Oh, did he chew it? No, I looked at it. He chewed that, bro. He did too. So what happens is, see how he did the spin? Yeah, that was weird. So he's doing the spin to get the angle to eat it. Oh. Yeah, it's really, really Devo. But they'll spin and spin and spin to get the right angle to come and eat it. So when he's doing that, you just do not move it. So you let him, let him decide how he wants to eat it. So that, it, although you may think that he's spooked, it's a very, very particular thing that a tusky does where he spins around it and tries to get the right angle to come in behind and eat it. So that's like, when I see that, it's a very good sign. A lot of people will be like, oh, he's spooked. I thought he was spooked. Yeah, but to me, it's like, no, nah, that's him committing. He's going to eat it. You just got to dead stick it. You did it like, you hooked up. You just went straight through his teeth. I'm, I'm on here, big game face on, because this is where we saw those big Deans. I'm still tripping out about casting in a foot of water and having a meat of fish jump out, like, When you come up the front, just be extremely quiet. Mm -hmm. I'm very tempted to put a cast in because I feel like if I get too close and I don't see one camoed in with the rocks. Mm. Are you looking for Tusky? No, I'm looking for Baz. I might, pick up I might just... Though. I might just put in a cast and see what happens. Just fire one along it. Because if there's a good fish, I really don't want to spook him. Spook him. I'd run. Oh, that's a barra. That was a barra. Oh, yep. look at him. Yep, yep. Yep. Put a cast in there, bro. There'll be a few. I'm gonna peel us out of the rocks a little bit. Yep. But just go, f yeah, fire one along there when you get a chance. I'm just trying to find the fire on the pocket. Beautiful. Come on, come on, come on. Oh my God. Oh yeah, there's yep. one there, there's one in there. He's coming, stop it, stop it. Not go again. Cast in there again. They're a big brim, so definitely saw one.
Hello, you chrome, beautiful creature. You need to go. No, no, I've got this guy. You do your thing, man. I'll get the net. Jump in. Oh, stop it right now. Look at that. Tilt top. On the other side. That is a very happy human right there. Straight out. <laughs> Does it get any cleaner than that? All right, buddy. Oh. Matt's done. Matt's very happy. Very happy. You know the crazy thing is this. We're just going to cut laps. Yeah. Over and over again. All right, so I have, I've received quite a few comments now. You guys would have noticed that I'm wearing a different style of sunnies. Um, these are actually called LXD, so it's live uh, making like the top of the range kind of fishing sunnies. It's called Live Extreme Division. They're actually out in stores at the moment. We're working on quite a few different lenses and colors. And at the moment, they're incredible, insanely good. So a lot of you guys would know live, you know, it's that... It's that really just perfect basic fishing lens, but they've taken it to the next level. And um, I think these things are going to be incredibly legit. Like from what I've seen at the moment and the way I'm seeing these fish, the colors, the browns, everything they're doing is absolutely spot on. So keep an eye out for those ones. Um, they're in BCF. Yeah, they're in BCF at the moment. But you're going to see me running them flat out because I'm very impressed with the lens. Slowly wandered, oh, slowly wandered in, slowly wandered in. Kind of lost him. Yeah, that's him there, that's him right there. That very slight little blue blob. So go again at that mangrove. Yep, sink it. He's coming, he's coming. He's eating it. Let him eat it, let him, okay, go. Go, 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 go. Yeah, beautiful. Just smoked him in. <laughs> oh no. Oh, come in here. Why yeah. don't ya? How's the set on it? <laughs> oh. That was full. Doesn't get much better, bro. Oi. Yes. The prototype's going so We're kicking cool. goals. That, <laughs> we just got a barra there. What is happening? I was going to these rocks here to see if we could get another barra on the way. They keep eating it. Like, we'll get him quickly yeah, well, up and back in. He's, he's a bit smaller than the last. He was so hard to see. Like, even when he turned, I lost him. It was just like he was the ultimate little camo critter. Look at that. Incredible creature. Beautiful fish. The eye. All right. Flick him on home. See ya, buddy. Gone. Sound. Mm. It's a very, very familiar, distinct, good sound. It only means good things. Oh. There it is. Oh, what was that? I don't know, but it was fast. 
Did you see that? I didn't actually see him, but... The silver. You reckon they're under this ledge? Yeah. Oh. Oops, sorry, Bob. Bit of rod touching. Oh, a bit of clashing of swordage. Oh. oh, that was a big barrow, man. <laughs> that was a big one. Right there. He came from under that ledge. There he is. Where? How did I, like... Oh, what's going on? Oh my God! Wow. I I seen it. I seen it. Don't understand. Don't want to eat. Nah. Nah. There's no dramas. Them eating it. I'm just cooking it. What's that? I don't know. Got some bangs. Jesus. Must be a cod. Yeah. Wow. Pretty big. Is it? Yeah. Oh, I got him. Doesn't he just know that? Look at him. Like. Yeah, he's like, I want to go there. <laughs> you want to go there? Nah, gam. I just popped out, so. Come on, buddy. Just play the game. Play the game. You know he's not that Oh, you man. All right, play the game. One more. Let's try this. I tried. Like, little headache. Give him some Panadol if you're right. you can hear me through this wind this southeast has just picked up which we thought it might have exactly on tide change which is something that you guys should um, keep an eye on it's quite quite common if you have a tide change and a wind like a north to south change it generally happens on the tide change so um what's that nice jack got a nice jack good on him um but yeah we're gonna punch it home quickly before this southerly gets real nasty Amazing day uh, to kind of have a game plan and actually go and do it. It's, pretty, it's rare that that stuff happens, but uh, we took a lot into consideration being wind tide and um, mainly the area. So it all kind of came out and um, wrapped. Epic little morning session. And uh, that's it. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. This made it two or three days. I get another clip out.